welcome back ladies and gentlemen i know it's been a while and that's because i have two jobs uh so that sucks but um i'm hoping bill head soon uh i just need to buy an ecu to manage the cams and uh well that'll be that'll be 240 wheel horsepower those um <laughs> ah, those cheap all seasons but anyways today we are working on hatch latch uh mine went out if you're wondering how we got it open the little silver thing you pull it down but um you might be able to hear it you might not no clicking sound so no bueno ups i wonder who that's for but I will get started pulling off this plastic so I can access all the bolts. Because here's the new one. There's three bolts. And obviously I need to be able to get to the wire. So I will be doing that. So as far as that goes, um, obviously it's pretty easy. It's literally just clips. Uh, I would say be careful not to break them. Because uh, the more clips you break, the less it holds on. So don't, so don't do that. Um, this one just slid out. So I can't really fix that either. That's probably one of the sources of the rattling sounds. And then all the, you know, spare tire kit in the back. But uh, that's that's what we need to get to right here. Oh, sorry about the view, but yep, there. And then that wire connector, boom. <coughs> it's been cold, so I have a cough. But um, yeah, should be um, pretty easy. And it looks like it's only three bolts. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hope that's uh, true. Um, so I will get going on that. It should be pretty straightforward. I don't know why it wouldn't be. So, oh, so many update. Boom, out. Brand new one. Or no, this is the old one. Is the old one? This is definitely the old one. Um. That thing looks, uh, low, little, where's for where? And this one, I was looking at the right one, jeez. Uh, yeah, I am. This one, well, it looks like they had the same problems. This one's a little chewed up too. This thing sucked. Um, it literally was, bending the metal uh, other than that super easy three bolts i hate electrical work and uh hashtag stripped interior bruh Ooh, so, yeah. all right now that everything's buttoned up moment of truth <laughs> this thing is temperamental mainly the car Thank God. <laughs> I think it's just because it's cold. Maybe one of the wires might be pinched. I don't really know. But I guess it doesn't actually make a sound when you do that. It also could be partially because of the button. That might be draining it. Yeah, it's like weird. I think it's the button. Next. Huh. I'm going to have to press unlock every time I want to do this now. That's weird. That might be why. Uh, well, it's in. It just get a working hatch latch, I guess. <sighs> the struggles. Ooh. It's okay, I guess. Oh, there it goes. Weird. It's, I don't know, it's doing its own thing. I think it's the button. So that's gonna be next. Where did that little plastic piece go? 
Yeah. Actually, I'm gonna leave that there, just in case. I think it's the button, though. The hatch latch definitely made a difference because it hasn't opened at all. That button might need to be replaced next. Um, anyways. Uh, slight update. I guess since uh, I have nothing else to do in this video. Um, like I said earlier, for all those subscribers sorry, that want to see this thing keep going which thank you don't don't mind the gap um yeah uh belt head uh, i'm i think i'm gonna hold off until spring because i'm on garbage well i'm on okay tires it's about to be winter and adding almost 100 wheel horsepower to this is not a good idea so yeah um on top of that rsx um we have everything for it uh my that doofus wants to get more parts and spend more money on things that we don't need it to run but whatever um but we have everything to make it run uh the limited slip diff is in the car from wave track uh what else i think that's the only that was the last thing we were waiting on was the transmission to be done and it's done they even did some work in it so it's got new synchros and stuff so hopefully that'll be driving also next spring but as it gets colder it kind of just sucks um after the built heads in i'm getting well i want to get uh new fenders or carbon fenders carbon hood carbon hatch means i'd re need to redo that spoiler and all right little club sticker that thing's that's that thing's grody i don't know what happened to it uh i want to do carbon mirrors i still want to do a carbon wheel so that's what i want to do that i don't have yet other than the ecu for the belt head um other than that though i also wanted to do new wheels i was thinking nto3s you know fix the fitment to where i don't have to run spacers that and this is a this is a little tucked in anyways still it's not terrible but it's not flush same with same with the back it's not terrible it's not flush but it's pretty much all for now after that getting this speckly winter paint job fixed along with uh you can come uh the camera does pick them up all the door dings this thing is collected from idiots uh there's a few more you can't really see them and then this this is the biggest eyesore this has been this like wrinkle has been here since i got the car from the previous owner they hit a wall opening their door like an idiot so and that um floof <laughs> i think that's uh, all i have it's been a while i have two jobs i need to get off the curb apparently because oh anyways getting distracted i have two jobs and then come february since one of them seasonal i'll have one job and be going back to school so we'll see what happens with content club is still going well it's it's just still going <laughs> hopefully we can figure things out for next year grow a little bit more we'll see we'll see what happens uh and hopefully soon i will be able to arrange an update video on alex gti i know that it's literally the least liked or least watched video on my entire channel but hear me out. It's a big turbo Mark V GTI with a full APA APR stage three package, which obviously includes that KL4. So it's really fast. And its winter setup is R triple eights. So hear me out. It'll be fun. But until next time, uh, I know I made this video a lot longer than I should have, but it's just because it was an update. 
But um, have a Merry Christmas, guys.